dedicated to open mic nights all across the world because it's amazing, isn't it, that we have this platform that we can come and stand on and say our words or sing our songs and do whatever we need to do. And it's such an amazing thing that we have this in this country and it's a real privilege, um, particularly for women, because in many countries they can't do this and it's a massive privilege and this poem is about me realising that and being grateful for it. Um, and it's called People Come Here. People come here to pour out their hearts so you all can taste their mind and find what's been wasted, what's been strained through the pains of thinking that nobody wants to hear, nobody wants to drink, but you're all here and you have ears, a sea of nodding faces, the graces of closed eyes sometimes. You've got to stand tall and tell your truth. I sometimes navigate my way around the proof and the facts. It's just that I can't calculate some sums. They sum me numb and some sums just sum up how lucky I am and tell me I have the world in the palm of my hand. And statistics are like a distant staircase that's slowly moving forward. And it's better ignored because it takes time to touch you. And then you empty your energy when you climb to the top and you stop. And then the penny drops and you get beckoned by this second wonder of what it is to say what you want. But thoughts are chores, and I have more to occupy my time. My mind is chock-a-block with cares and stresses that get messed up and they lessen the importance of this. And I start to lose the lesson of what it is to listen. I learned that such a long time ago. So I build tactics of time-taking, I am money-making, so far away from the back-breaking and freedom-taking that I am blind to the shadow-shaking, but for the sake of it all, I appreciate this reasoning that I have and freedom of speech. I have the ability to reach out and stand tall and shout, but I have freedom to fall and make mistakes, to take what I need, to cry when I please and when my heart breaks. Look at me standing in front of you. I have words in my mouth that I can move and mould to what I choose, and I have two shoes on my feet and a seat to sit down on, and I can speak for the ground on which I stand on, and my belly is full and fat. My belly is full and fat. I want to shout that until I'm out of breath and beauty, like it's my duty to go on a journey and return this, this right here, to every woman. Give her what she wishes. Expression with exceptions of imperfections take her away from washing dishes and learn again the lesson of what it is to listen. Don't put words in her mouth or thoughts in her head. Just give her time and hear what has been said. Thank you.